Okay guys, this is a lap pull down machine. It's very similar to a lap pull down cable machine. So what we're doing here is, firstly, I'm getting in a nice sturdy position, feet are on the floor. I'm activating my lats, so that's one of the main, main muscles I'm gonna be using during this exercise. I'm gonna be using my rhomboids, I'm gonna be using my real delts and my biceps as well, but mostly focusing on our lats here, okay? So, so lats are activated, shoulders back and down. What might happen when you do this shoulders back and down and chest up is your abs will come forward, so we wanna be activating our abs, keeping our core nice and neutral, okay? So then we wanna be pulling down with our lats engaged. So at the bottom of the movement, I'm actually visualizing my elbows coming together and squeezing the movement and making it even more, more lat dominant. So there's a lot of things that go wrong with this movement. And the first thing is not driving the movement or stimulating the lats while you're doing the movement. So what I'll see is people pulling from this relaxed position and then as they're pulling, the shoulders come up and they're not using the lats at all. And you see, if I pull down with my lats from this position, my shoulders look very different. So it's about having this lat activation, shoulders back and down during the whole movement. Another thing I see is people using momentum to lift the weight. So a whole body movement to just get the weight down. Okay, you can definitely lift more weight like this, but you're using momentum rather than using the muscles we're trying to work. And this is a hypertrophy movement where we're trying to build the lat muscles and the back muscles. So we need to focus on Nice, controlled, slow movement, just using the back muscles and not the whole body to do the movement, okay? Another thing I see is we've got this lat activation going on, but people get to this position and it, you can't go any further without rolling your shoulders forwards. So once you roll your shoulders forwards, you're in actually, a, your shoulders are in a dangerous position and you can get some injuries from here. So don't roll forward. The idea is to keep your shoulders back and down squeeze on level i see my hands on level with my face squeeze on level with your face and that's definitely far enough to go on this movement so last but not least another movement i see which can go wrong sometimes and cause injury is people will pull their shoulders down great but as they get to this position they bend their wrists and use their wrists to pull it down so we want to be keeping the wrist nice and nice and neutral so we're not using a forearm to do the movement we're keeping it nice and straight and that's going to save the forearms and any injuries around the elbow so that guys is the lat pull down. We can do this in the beginning to help us understand that movement. Once you've got that, just keep your, keep your lats nice and tight. So that's the lat pull down machine. If you need any more help with any of your training in the gym, feel free to ask one of the personal trainers on the gym for, they'll be happy to help.